The regular EKG has 12 ways of looking uh, at the heart. Okay. The patient wears this uh, space age looking uh, vest. You look like a skeleton. It's like black and white and it's all leads. So they can hook it up to the computer and see if they, they draw a picture of the heart and make it easy for the doctor to do the procedure. And all you really need to capture is one or two of those extra beats or those abnormal uh, rhythms and this Cardio Insight vest will give you a very, very, very good idea uh, of where the electrical abnormality is before we actually, uh, you know, do our procedure. Lewis had uh, a situation where there were some extra beats that were coming from uh, the bottom chambers of the heart. The cardiologist told me what I had, you know, you have an arrhythmia and it has to be taken care of, it's called an ablation. You tell us when you're ready, we can capture a pacing. Lewis's uh, type of arrhythmia problem is actually the kind of problem that that can be an issue. The way that we used to do things is we'd bring the patient to the laboratory and hope with various maneuvers, etc., that we had, hope to try to induce the arrhythmia problem. We were able, in Lewis's case, to go ahead and fix the problem without needing to worry about not having that many beats to map during the procedure. Based upon the way the case was going in the laboratory, uh, it would have been much harder in a longer case or ultimately a, a, a case that we wouldn't have been able to offer him any therapy had we not had the information from the cardio inside. I'm glad it worked out. You know, if everything worked out for me, then hopefully it'll work out for the next patient. Premature ventricular contraction. Oh, which is the thing that saw them already. We saw three, yeah, and they look like they're all the same. So that's good news. That's why we do this. We're really excited to have uh, this technology. We're one of the first hospitals in the country to be taking advantage of this technology. Uh, we're very excited about the opportunity to potentially do some more research, perhaps set some, some new standards about how we uh, should approach certain types of procedures uh, and show some really positive outcomes uh, for patients.